Thank you, thank you everyone coming back to our studio. So today we're going to start a new series, okay? So our Bagua uh, Dao uh, series, and then one of the typical one is what we call the queue, the queuing enemy saber or queuing enemy Dao Satito, okay? Or what we call Bagua Satito because that is the simplified form of our Bagua Dao. Okay, our Bagua Dao is very, uh, very light the selling Dao. I would say like like uh, a bit like the yin fu style bagua dao as well so it's very linear and then we're just going to start and this one we will uh that's a more simplified and then this one is uh, what fu chan sung was teaching for the military training during the uh the japanese invasion during the world war ii okay so my father visited me here in australia so that's why i kept, so i get him to recording what is the uh sadito okay the killing enemy saber uh, were teaching by his uncle Jai Yong Ji. Okay, so it's my great uncle. So, uh, so that is how I learned the form as well. So that's it. So I'm gonna ask him to demonstrate um, how 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 to do the form in this session, and then we're just doing one session and one session. Okay. So let's start. Okay. How 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 we start the form? Okay. Okay. So we put him up what we call the uh, the hidden Tao session okay and then and then that is the step and then that is the chin tao bolo do okay and then the first session couple step step and then they uh, we work chop that's the whole thing and stay back and then this is the first so okay so my father's just gonna step by step to oh. show this session first okay so okay you basic how to eat. You basic how to eat. Yeah. So that's a prepare ready session. Chong do. And then there's the the hiding the oh. dao's posture. And then step. Okay. And then that's the chin dao do. All the do. Oh, sorry. That's the the hidden dao. Okay. Pretty much like all the all the one here. And then so we will doing with the uh, shu bu. Okay. The empty stand. Okay. Shang and bo, then do. one, two, three, three step. Mm. And then we do the chin dao do. Chop into oh. the neck and then the sun shang bo so that's the reverse cut okay and then so that is the whole stand chopping and then the reverse hiding down okay now so and then i will get my father just do one from this session as well now. okay so starting posture again so the hiding, yeah and then so step and then chop and then go do okay and then one do. chop is the and then we work cut and then whole stand we work cut and the hiding posture again okay so now we can talk about the um the side application in here okay so pretty much like in here uh from the from the beginning posture the requirement it's just like this so when the dao coming up so this is coming under the elbow and hiding here with the posture okay then step 45 step there to the heart and then one two three oh sorry again so i just talk about a little bit more detail because my father Bit nervous so when we start just like how we start the posture normally and then hide here and then step 45 uh, step 90 degree step straight to the heart okay and then so chin tau okay so that is the coming under and the step back and sit back okay then one two three okay step into the neck uh chop into the neck and then facing this side one two three the reverse cut to the neck okay after that we do the whole stand coming back and hiding the down okay so that's the a little bit detail and then if I do it from the back, from uh, from beginning, 
we will like this step okay and then we talk about the application in here <coughs> the, uh, the actual application so pretty much like in beginning it's just the uh, how we opening in here so it's the sighting just like normal down posture okay so the first one is my father gonna chop me so and then we just hide and then step in the heart so that is pretty much like pretty much like in the pedagogy way is he chopping from the top okay so pretty much one two and step so that's why the hanging here is pretty much like is for to to parry so that's but of course like in the form we're just doing this one okay but in the actual is you still have to from a big long distance so you still have to parry okay okay parry okay to step that's the first one okay now after that so we after the step we will do the chin like all the Tao application nothing wrong when he chopped me let out jump right just get getting cut here and then from this direction from this side crossing from my right low on my right hand side just lie it here okay so that's pretty much the uh, the first one and then so when he when he went in this distance of course like not in this distance and he to the chop me who died that uh. so that is the first stepping one one two three okay this one is just practicing how we cut and then after that same thing he's gonna cut me for the uh that is the outer gate that's the inside inside gate so after if i miss it and then he's gonna chop me from this side pop. that's the we were cuts okay so pretty much that is about it of course like if he could step me in the middle pop, that is the first one all right and then in the movement when he when he okay after that when he suddenly after i do this and then someone come from the back so pretty much i just reverse back or i just reverse back and cut this okay pretty much like uh that's about it but in a very cold distance of course like it in a very long distance pretty much like uh well that is not safe to be honest so in this arm distance you can do it in the parry hand okay and then chop to the back so that is the first session we're going to talk about it first and then we will continue in the next one thank you mm -hmm.